underlying energy that we're working with here today is the five of swords this is ruthlessness getting doing everything that you need to do to win to get what you want um this is also some uh, the kind of selfish card you're possibly dealing with something that's very selfish right now or perhaps you're being a little selfish um or empty victories so you're dealing with a victory that um isn't is lacking in emotional fulfillment so you just you want something but you just it's not fulfilling it's not feeling very hot you're not feeling too hot after um so we're gonna go ahead and look at the rest of the reading to base uh, to get a better understanding of what the underlying energy really means um the problem circumstance is the page of pentacles this is about a solid offer or a solid um yeah a solid offer basically someone offered to you or you offered to someone else but it's being crossed by the page of swords blunt communication so perhaps someone's not being honest about what they want in regards to the solid offer maybe someone is not speaking their truth in regards to the honest offer that they're getting um or um someone is being someone is speaking their truth bluntly about regard uh, regarding the the, um, the page of pentacles or there's just no there's no communication at all um interestingly enough you guys have the page of cups in your crowning energy it's very interesting what you guys got here you guys got the five of swords at the very top but then you have all pages in one row and then you have major arcana in the, in the last row it's very interesting and they're all uh, if you look at, if you count them, the bottom, they're all even numbers. Even though death is 13, you have, it, if you add the one with three, that's four. So you have four, six, and two. Very interesting. Um, but the page of cups represents a message um, regarding feelings. So perhaps you want to speak your feelings, you want to express your feelings, or you want an offer of love to be received, or to offer that love, um, that page, sorry, that, offer that message of love to someone. In the past, you were dealing with some change, some slow and gradual change, some transforming change. Um, this could be in regards to your love life, um, some slow and gradual change within your love life. For those of you that are single, this could be transitioning within yourself. For couples, this could be a change for the better for both of you guys. In the present, you have the lovers. This is making a decision based off of love and um, your head, your mind, trying to figure out, a, trying to make a decision between your head and heart. But this is also generally a love card as well. So um, whatever you guys decide, it's based off of love. And whatever this love, um, whatever this decision you guys make, it could potentially lead you to a new beginning in regards to a second chance. So this is renewal, Phoenix rising up from the ashes. So things coming back again um, to start over. So this could, uh, this is definitely, um, this is definitely um, something I would love to clarify. So let's go ahead and get that clarifying start here. Okay, Page of Pentacles. Please clarify the Page of Pentacles. Ah, really interesting, guys. To clarify the Page of Pentacles is the Page of Swords. So, this is a very, um, very clear and cut offer. Someone that's speaking the very truth. Or this could be someone spying. Uh, this, I forgot. The Page of Swords is also the spy card. Perhaps someone is spying on you guys. Um, but... Um, this is a solid offer based off a of communication that's very, um, very clear, very, um, very, um, very blunt. The best word I can think of at the moment. So this is very, this could be very tactless kind of speak as well. Um, oof, this is also, um, this is also about truth. So this is basically like a true someone that's speaking their truth in regards to an offer so it regards to this is a new beginning it's very interesting that you guys get this to clarify the page of pentacles what is <clears throat> let's clarify the page of swords let's 
I find pages sorts. I find page sorts. Huh. So you got two cards coming out, um, Sagittarius, uh, for the Page of Swords. You have the Page of Wands and the Eight of Wands. So this is in regards to some news, um, some news and some fast communication messages. So maybe you have received or maybe you're receiving an offer of somebody speaking their truth to you as they will offer possibly to go into the next level. Um, but there isn't any messages back. You haven't heard any news back from them. No one's speaking their truth. Um, no one is responding. Maybe, um, or maybe there was a response and it's, it's a very, it's, it's interesting. It's a spark of some new passions and things. Huh. It was all in regards to messages and, and some, uh, uh, some news in regards to messages. Or news within messages, I should say. All right. Clarify the page of cups and the crowning energy. Clarify the page of cups and the crowning energy. Okay. You have the devil as the um, as the underlying. Sorry, as the un as the clarifying energy for the page of cups. So this could mean um, because. Um, Hmm. It could be offering new love. This could be sex. This could be um, drugs as well because the um, cup um, water um, is um, um, not water, but Neptune um, is seen as like the drugs, the um, illusion cards, uh, the illusion uh, planets, and they, he represents drugs, and he represents drugs through Pisces. Um, because he rules Pisces. Uh, so this could be speaking of um, you maybe wanting to maybe get high or to smoke or go back into bad habits. Um, or maybe you're dealing with a bad habit right now or a habit that you uh, is in regards to some um, some going to drugs or um, unhealthy habits. Or you could be wanting um, to offer love um, in regards to some, um, I guess, maybe sexual love. Maybe you're feeling passionate um, at the moment. It's very difficult to say. Um, what is, why is death coming up in the past? Why is death coming up in the past? Ah. Perhaps because you... You did everything you could to get what you wanted, regardless of the circumstance. Or maybe there was some some un, some battle that was some maybe not battle, but something that went down, and you're not exactly happy about how it turned out, even though you, you got what you needed. So it's a slow transition and change based off of things. Runs off of that. All right, what is this decision you have to make in the present? What is to what is the lovers? Lover is conflict. So this is some conflict going on in the present with you guys in regards to your love life. Um, so in your love life, there's some conflicts. There's some challenges right now. It's always um, intense when you go into them, but um, they're very short-lived. So um, this is a, maybe you're just deciding between your head and heart. Maybe trying to um, decide something in regards to this, to, to what's going on right now with you guys. Or maybe you're making a decision based off the of past conflicts. Are you trying to decide something? What is the justice? Sorry, ju um, what is judgment in the future? Please clarify the judgment in the future. Why is judgment in the future? in the future. Ah, uh, the Eight of Swords. <clears throat> the Eight of Swords speaks of um, feeling stuck, overthinking, 
um, not seeing things clearly and because your thoughts are so blinding. Um, so perhaps this is a new beginning and where um, you have to, you know, that's it, it's making you feel stuck. Maybe you're feeling stuck again in the future. Oof, that's really crazy. I hope not. Um, maybe it could lead you to feeling stuck. Or maybe it'll lead you to feeling like you have a lot to think about or, or bring up lots of thoughts that can't that aren't really um that aren't very clear um but in your outcome you have the high priestess someone that uses wisdom knowledge um you will receive knowledge in this outcome that is the that is what i'm saying through all of this you will receive knowledge and to clarify that you have the five of pentacles so this could be without help without receiving help ignoring help um you could be going through this pretty much by yourself um it, i don't know if, if you're if you're in a relationship i don't think it's maybe not lack of support maybe you don't need the help or you're not you're ignoring the help that's given to you or for those that are single that you have no support but you're beginning this knowledge on your own to summarize the whole reading here, this is based um, the, uh, this is based off of energy is based thing off of ruthlessness, um, doing what you need to do to survive, or perhaps doing whatever you can to win, regardless of um, how you feel about it. Um, this could be in regards to someone else or the situation all together. Just um, maybe not trying to win all the time. It's not it's not about that. It's not like you guys are trying to like do whatever it takes to win but this there's some sort of there's some sort of um some sort of energy here that's basically saying that not for you guys like i repeat but it's definitely some sort of ruthless energy here in regards so there's something possibly some some stuff going on between you and your partner that needs to be straightened out and you're trying to do everything you can to fix it or your partner's trying to do everything you can to fix it um, there could be some something wrong or something going on in your relationship right now that's causing this five of swords to come up now and the heart of your reading you have a stable offer in regards to a blunt message um but it's not being received back possibly in a um with a with a, with a um with a um truthful message um or perhaps there is a message that came back it's some fast communication going on in regards to some news that has been received what you do guys want is love, but um, you're dealing possibly with a with a um, with an attachment of some sort, some um, unhealthy habits. Possibly, uh, you you're dealing with going back to it's possibly smoking or drinking, um, or this could be in regards to uh, someone that you feel very uh, much attached to. There's a connection, a deep connection between you two. Um, and you're off you're wanting to offer love or express your feelings into within this relationship that feels kind of that feels um, rather intimate uh, because this devil does mean that uh, you are like if you're you know you're not trapped because they have chains around their neck they don't look distressed they're literally they have to be there they're there for as long as they want to be so it's an attachment, but it doesn't have to be a bad attachment. It's all about your free will. In the past, you had certain gradual change because things had to be, because because there was a victory that was emotionally unfulfilling, possibly in the past. Currently, you're dealing with a decision that you have to make in regards to some conflicts within your love life. But in the future, you have a reset, um, but it could be sort of, it can make you feel um, stuck. There's going to be a lot of, there could be a lot of thoughts um, it, that could keep you from seeing what's right in front of you and more focused in your head. Or try your best not to feel this way if you can help it. But your outcome will lead you to having more wisdom um, that possibly that you don't need help with. Um, this is basically a support that you definitely don't need because it's within yourself, possibly. This knowledge, um, this wisdom. Um, and, um, or, uh, this could be, um, not receiving the help, the, the help that you need and that's giving you that wisdom yourself.
all right so all that said i'm going to show you your wisdom or of the oracle and your um romance angels soulmate yes this is your soulmate so this is somebody that's definitely come back in come into your life to teach you something to show you something soulmates are about helping you get to your highest potential so whatever is going on in your guys lives right now love lives or whatever the conflicts the the five of swords all the change cards that keeps coming up because you do have uh death Jud and judgment those are changes and then you have all the five you have five swords five swords again and then you have the five of wands those speak of change fives are changes they can be feel intense in the time that you're going through them but they're also very short-lived so with all these changes going on this is making this is what's going to get you um new um new knowledge about yourself this could be a, something that you have to learn something that you have to see so whatever's going on, this is in regards to your soulmate. Somebody's this person is here for you to you for you to see, for you to see something new, to see and to learn something new. They're help they're there to help you grow. Okay, so this is your soulmate. That's that, that is what you're dealing with right now in regards to your love life, and the wisdom of the oracle is fifteen message in the bottle. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So message in the bottle. Communication, a sign, a cledon, the ancient name for a spontaneous oracle delivered innocently by the speaker, pointing the way to your greatest, to your highest good. Oracle message. Spirit sends you signs when you ask for them, when you believe you will receive them, and when you allow yourself to become fluent in the language of symbols, oracles, and omens. They may come to you as a bird flying by, a logo on a truck, a, and a song on a radio. Expect confirm, confirmation that you're pointed in the right direction. Keep your ears open, for someone might say just the right thing that will give you the answer to your, to your query. Uh, today, your message is this. Spirit hears you and the reply is favorable. Relationship message. You can expect someone to favor you with positive news. This could be in the form of a letter, phone call, or email. You are intended, um, you are the intended receiver of this message, so stay open to what you learn. Only good will come of it in the end. The signs are all there. So this is this is good. So this could mean that there's going to be a response to the message and this is receiving news.